Frequent flyers fly, la 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 la. Frequent flyers bat. What's up? You checking out the Frequent Flyer? Welcome back to the channel. Smash the like button to show your support. If you're new to the channel, I'd like to extend a warm welcome. Back out here at the park. It's Wacky Wednesday, y'all. And I'm out here with a new quad <laughs> that I want to fly. And uh, this one is going to be HD0 or HD0 Whoop. <laughs> and so this one. I got a lot of high hopes for this one guys it's showing a lot of promise I haven't flown it outdoors so this is going to be the maiden flight of it but as you can see I use that 75 Pro from uh, Beta FPV the frame that cheats <laughs> with the slightly larger uh, prop size there so <laughs> I can't remember I have it on screen what size these props are but they are a little larger than the 75 millimeter uh, whoop frame props are supposed to be and so a little extra boost with it and all and I have this HD zero whoop light system in here check it out and of course we got a GMB 850 on here I had to split the frame in order to get these batteries to fit <laughs> Wanted to go a little larger on the battery size. I do have some smaller batteries out here too uh, for some lighter, better performance, but I just was looking for an 850 to fit. And you guys can't really see under there, but I also have the Beta FPV all-in-one flight controller 1S with Express LRS in it. So the best of both worlds. <laughs> I have HD0 and Express LRS in here. And we have this BT 2.0 connection. Beta FPV is going with that board now. With the uh, power lead. They're going with this power lead on the board. I have my Jumper T Pro Express LRS version out here. Got my funky uh, <laughs> thumb pads on there. Thumb extensions. And uh, I'm equipped with the Emacs. HD zero system from the transporter to HD. So I've got that monitor out here <laughs> for my HD zero. I did see a video uh, from another YouTuber and he had a, a version of a bundle from Emacs. I sent Emacs an email to find out if it was true or not. They haven't responded. I haven't seen them respond. But the link that he had up there for the bundle. Uh, it was a uh, the wrong link. The link only linked to an old analog bundle. But uh, oh yeah, I didn't even tell you guys what it was. It was a Emacs Tiny Hawk with HD zero in it. So of course I was intrigued by that. I wanted to try it out. I went to the link and it wasn't in the link, but he was flying it in the video. I don't know if he uh, yeah maybe he just uh, jumped past the embargo by mistake or something like that I don't know but looks awesome I really wanted to try it but anyhow back to this let's get this guy up in the air see how it flies really curious to see how this thing does I got this apparatus on me <laughs> around my neck to support this HD zero monitor and I forgot that I didn't ch I grabbed one of my 850s that I didn't change the battery lead the power lead so I'm gonna have to go with a smaller one we're going with the 550 so hopefully good results still actually should make it perform better because it's gonna be lighter oh and I forgot to show that I made the I uh, spun the board around to make the uh, battery mounting be sideways. So side mounting battery. Okay, so let's get it. Oops, I didn't turn the monitor on.
<laughs> let's stop the quad. I got the quad spinning up and all. Sheesh. Forgot what side the power button was on. I got it now though, y'all. <laughs> Okay, it's powering on. Hopefully it connects. Okay, so it connected, no problem. Sheesh, we got motorcycles flying around. Making a lot of noise out here. I don't see it recording. It's supposed to auto record. It's saying there's no, it's saying there's no, uh, there's a problem with the, uh, Card. Let me try to put the card back in again. Sheesh, the card don't seem like it's working. Let's power it off. Power it back on. A little chilly out here too, y'all. Oh man, this card isn't recording. Sheesh, there's always something. Well, let's get this thing up in the air. I am happy to see that it does fly at least. We're in angle mode here. Let's try a punch out with it. So not bad for an HD Zero system on a whoop. This thing flies. I'm flying it in angle mode right now. Let me go to Acro. Okay, we're in acro mode now. So everything is working fine. Still no active buzzer on it. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to look at the monitor. Keep an eye on it. Whoa! <laughs> Sheesh! I guess I'm limited on how I can fly acro. Can't really do too many uh, power loops and all. Let's see. Got to go up real how to do a power loop. So at least I know it flies. It's connected to this Jumper T Pro. We have HD Zero working. I just got to get the card. <laughs> I got my rate kind of low. <laughs> right past the branches. <laughs> uh oh. Didn't get past the branches that time. <laughs> oh, I feel like it's getting a little weak. Can you look at it? Jeez, my OSD isn't showing up. I didn't program the OSD on this thing. But let me bring it in because it seems like it's going down. Well, actually, the video is still showing. Yeah, let me stop it. It looked like something ran past me. Was that a squirrel? <laughs> I don't know. But uh, at least I know this thing flies. Awesome little, uh, uh, I guess this can be called a Franken build <laughs> because uh, I got parts uh, swapped. Well, actually, this is all beta FPV stuff. So, no, this I won't say this is a Franken build. This is just a, a, a model that we would probably like. <laughs> so, beta FPV, if you're watching this, this is what we want, y'all. <laughs> Seems a little better than a 75, uh, just a 75 millimeter whoop uh, frame size. You know, having those slightly larger props gives it a little bit more power and all with HD Zero. So definitely gonna come back out here with a better um, SD card, maybe one that's more compatible, <laughs> preferably. <laughs> uh, I, I think this one is a high speed one, so I'm not sure why it's not uh, 
working maybe it's full or something i don't know but i would think that on the monitor it would say full if the thing was actually full but anyhow awesome little uh, creation from beta fpv parts on wacky wednesday thanks for watching